so hey guys welcome back to the channel today i gotta grind two stumps one's a magnolia stump and the other one is a uh, uh maple stump one of them is dead and the other the magnolia stump is still uh solid and uh i'll show you what i'm talking about so this one right here not i knocked it out in like two or three minutes and this one over here is going to take a little bit to do but it, it'll be quick small job it pays very well and on these small jobs you can make uh just as much money than you can do on a larger job if you bid it right so when you're starting out you know i used to be fall for the old trick of uh hey will you grind this stump for 30 40 dollars i'll just go rent one they used to say and so i used to fall for that little trick uh one or two times and then i called a rental company and i asked them i said how much does it cost to rent one they said they said a hundred dollars and uh now i called the other day and there's 300 350 a day to rent a stump grinder so if i was a new guy starting out i'd uh you know don't be fooled by somebody saying hey i'll go rent one i'll go do it myself you know i can rent one down there a man beater for a hundred dollars two hundred dollars whatever it is and i'll do these there you know i'll do it myself well if that's the case then they got to fill the gas up they got to rent it they got to pay insurance on the machine they got to return the machine in their car with their or their truck or whatever they're renting and then their time you roll up you, you know you say two or three hundred dollars and you do it in 30 minutes 45 minutes and you're gone i mean you know they're not really saving any money if you do it that way so if if i was you i wouldn't you know don't play that game with them you know just do the stumps and uh tell them a price and you know don't be half price charlie and try to do it for 50 dollars or 75 dollars just uh you know you're you got your cost of the machine you got maintenance on your machine you got you know your time and your uh your you know energy and effort and everything else i mean you got you got a lot of you got teeth and maintenance and uh gas the gas the diesel is going up to you know 550 or you know five dollars a gallon i mean come on now i mean you you put three gallons in your stump grinder there's 15 uh 16 dollars right there so you can't go out and do a stump then you throw that in there with your car you can't do a stump for that i mean there ain't no way so yeah i mean everybody's got to raise their prices up in this economy like it is and um keep doing it you know but uh if i was you you know my suggestion would be is uh don't pass on these small stumps you can do very well at the uh the real small ones and uh if you hit two or three of them a day or even four of them a day and you're making 350 a pop uh man you you know hey that's pretty good money right there and it ain't really hard you know like it's real bad you know labor wise or real tough on your body or you know and stuff like that and i've been doing it for uh since 2000 uh five i started out with a 252 vermeer now i run a you know a medium-sized reiko um and this is plenty to do jobs man if you're in the market and looking for one i'd buy one of these i mean you know you got all these guys that buy hundred thousand dollar uh track machines and seventy five thousand and all that well you gotta man you gotta do a lot of work uh you gotta do a lot of these right here and then you got to know a lot of people to do the work you know like tree companies concrete people um fence companies i mean there you you know you got to meet a lot of people to sell hundred thousand dollars worth of stumps and you have to have it outright and then if you take on payments and right now with the uh you know with the interest rates going up to five percent on the loan i mean uh you know is it really worth uh buying a hundred thousand dollar stump grinder or a, or a seventy five thousand dollar stump grinder then you got to buy a truck to pull it with
Oh, so guys, I got that knocked out and uh, no problem. A little quick little job, call it a day. They went to lunch. When they get back, they'll rake up and do uh, throw the, you know, the stuff in the truck and uh, you know, it'd be a quick little, uh, little bit of cash or a little bit of uh, money in my pocket today. Nothing big, but don't pass up on them small jobs telling you i'd rather i'd rather do small jobs you know than the, the real huge ones any day of the week and i make just as much money if not more doing small stumps so i wouldn't pass it up man the money's still good and uh you'll do you'll do very well hey guys if you like the channel hit the like button and the subscribe button and i'll see you on the next one